everybody. Howdy y'all. It's Shannon from Creative Chaos in Tennessee. And today we are back with a layout share. This is all of the layouts that I got done in January. Um, I actually have my totals for you. But I think I'll wait till the end. <laughs> uh, build a little suspense, you know. Um, I actually calculated layouts, pictures, and swap items use this month so these are not in any special order it's just how i pulled them out of my rack um so this one was a two page that i did um of us on vacation with the carousel um i love this i love the color palette and it shows up so much lighter on camera than it is in real life but i absolutely love them and i use sequins and did a little mixed media Next up is this one of us on vacation in the Smokies. I used a collage photo that um, my camera had actually made for me. So, and um, I used a Vicky Booten uh, paper, and then I let pretty much the paper do most of the work for me. And all of these do have. Um, Process videos if you're interested in going back or if you missed any of them that you wanted to watch. And um, this one is the first one from the um, Shake It, Scrap It, Create It um, challenge that I started. And um, a lot of fun. Band photos have lots and lots of those. <laughs> Y'all saw me paint up the chipboard and use this as my A for band. Um... So, had fun making that one. I have lots more band pictures to get scrapbook though. <laughs> I don't know if I'll ever be done. Okay, this one is a fishing layout. Did a lot of mixed media on it. Used a lot of swap items. Almost all of this was swaps and scraps. Of course, because I played along with Baby Got Scraps this month. Um... I'm also joining a few new hops this year, like Stamp It Like It's Hot and Mad About Mini Paper Pads. So, I'm really excited about those. This is another layout I did. Um, using up scraps, um, doing some Disney fo uh, pictures. This one was Stamp It Like It's Hot because I stamped on the picture and embossed it. Um, used up lots of swap items. Kept it very simple. Um, I've noticed I'm trying to... I noticed that I have kept things more simple and that I'm fitting way more on my pages. But that's okay. It's my pages, right? And just like it's yours and you have to do what works for you. So I feel like I'm still getting all of my embellishments in. I'm still telling the story, but I'm still getting a lot of pictures. This one was a Christmas layout, of course, of us making gingerbreads. This was a swap piece that I decked out. And then I used flip flaps to get more photos on here. So, I have all of these and they can flip open. And have my journaling under there. The same thing over here. I can just flip them up. And I am going to um, run these out of the page protector once i put them in i'll just cut a little slit and slide them through so that you can access it without pulling the page out so i was really happy with that one even though it's busy i have a lot of photos on there here is another christmas layout this one's deck the halls i used all swap stuff um very simple but I feel like it does the job. So. Here's another Christmas layout. I've packed all my Christmas stuff up now. So. A little bit sad about it. Because <laughs> I have so many Christmas pictures. But that's okay. Um, I used up lots of swap items. Most of it being from Sherry. Um, with all the beautiful things she gifted me. Um, and then just using up some paper scraps. So, I absolutely love this one. 
And then we have this one. I did a little bit of mixed media on it. It's hard to see on camera. Used up some swap stuff. Some, um... Scraps, some swap items. I don't know where I was going with that train of thought. <laughs> um, I know it's hard to see, but it has shimmer on it and splatters. And then... I have this layout I did. Um, just use a uh, let the pattern paper do all the work for me. Added a few swap items and have a layout done. Here's another Christmas one. And this was us baking this year. It was very different this year um, than in years past. But uh, we were sick, so Christmas got canceled. And we did it on New Year's Eve. And um, so me and Brooke just baked up stuff that we had because we hadn't been out to get really do any shopping because we were so sick. But we had fun. And it's really just about spending time together and making the memories anyways. This one I love. Um, this was me playing Mario Kart at Dave & Buster's for Brooke's birthday last year. Of course, I was number one because Princess Peach is always number one. So, you can of course watch the process video to see how I did this. Um, lots of glitter, shine and all that on it um love this one super 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 simple um this one was brooked at military ball i literally just fussy cut around some stuff on the paper and put the photo in and added some flowers and a title and boom it was done but i love this one have this one I did um little did I know we would be having a lot more winter <laughs> we had got snowed in for 10 days so um but I love this one um and this was just a snapchat picture that I stole from Brooke and then this was another uh, shake it scrap it create it page and, um, this one is, um, all you need is love, tacos, and chocolate, because that's all you need, right? <laughs> um, lots of fun doing this one. Use lots of, um, swap embellishments on there. Here is this one I did of the baked bread. Um, I have the recipe on there. I did share it in the video if you're interested in the process video for that. So, alright. And then here's this one that I did using 6x6 paper pads and lots of swap stuff on it. I hear a stink bug flying around. Here's this one I did using this gigantic penguin. Um, I ended up having to do surgery and cutting his foot off. <laughs> but um, I actually like how this one turned out. And that was the end of the ice skating pictures, finally. Um, so, um, well, for now. Because I'm sure I'll probably have more. And then, last but not least, is this one. I absolutely love this one. This one's probably my most favorite of the whole month that I did. And it has lots of shimmer and sequins and just snowy goodness on it. And I know it's hard to see, but it's so pretty in person. And the colors are so much more vibrant. If you have this um, 49 and Market collection, this one's Spectrum Sherbert, you'll know what I'm talking about, that it's way more vibrant. So, that is all I have for you this time around, and I hope you guys will come back and hang out. If you're not a subscriber, I would love to have you, 
and I would love a like. Um, hit that like button if you like this video. Um, I'm still planning out my year and what I'm going to be doing, but I'm excited about everything. So until next time, bye y'all. Okay, so I forgot to tell y'all my totals. <laughs> I waited till the end and then I forgot. Okay, so for January, I ended up scrapbooking 25 layouts, 75 pictures, and I used 84 swap items. So, I'm going to consider that a success. Um, I am going to track swap items that I use all year this year just to see how many I could use up. Um, you know, I would like to kind of get to 5,000. That's probably reaching a little bit. Um, but I've already used 84 in a month, so, um, maybe a thousand's probably a better goal, but I feel like I can really pass that up, but I do have a thousand pictures scrapped goal, um, I don't really have a page number, uh, goal to reach, so, um, we'll see how it goes, so, um, you guys come back and join me for the journey. Until next time, bye y'all.